which is the messiest thing ever. It's food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Iceland and TGI Fridays have collaborated again with a new product. I like the sound of this. I seen it on Instagram and I thought, yeah, let's, um, let's pick this one up. So I went over to Iceland this morning. There it was in the fridge. It was four pounds to buy. It's their chicken Louisiana hot mess with Frank's red hot buffalo wing sauce and ranch sauce. There's a look at it. It's 400 grams. It's, it was, yeah, I mentioned it was four pounds. And fun fact, fun fact about this one, I was gonna go and take this and put it in the oven, but they've actually got guidelines. This is the first time I have ever had a packet of food from somewhere where they've got an air fryer guideline on how to cook the food. So this is air fry, uh, 1,400 watts, four litre from frozen, um, set temperature to 200 degrees. We always do. Um, or gas max, oh no, well, the gas, then you've got gas max. So it's 26 minutes in the oven, gas max seven, or 200 degrees on a fan assisted oven, or in the air fryer, 18 minutes. Set the sachets to one side, and off we go. So this is what you get. I don't know, I'm starting to think already. Four pound? Four. Essentially, two. Two chicken breasts. What I'm gonna do, I'll double check the price, because I'm thinking four pounds is a bit steep. Did I get the price right? Oh, so, right, first and foremost, they need splitting. They just about go in, just about go in the air fryer. Bang, get it in. On 18 minutes. So I'm supposing this stuff now should Theoretically, just mush it up a bit, melt whilst I'm breaking it up a bit to make it easier to melt. That should melt by the time the food's cooked. While it's cooking, I'm going to go and double check the price. Okay, the air fryer has dinged, but most importantly, I have checked the price and they were four pounds. I thought they were, but I had to double check. I think that's a lot of money for two chicken breasts. Two of those. It wasn't so long ago you could buy two bird's eye chicken breasts just like this for two pound. In fact, I reckon if you didn't went to the bird's eye aisle in Iceland or Morrison's or Tesco and picked up some bird's eye chicken breasts, they'd probably cost you two pounds. They might be a bit smaller, but I thought that I think I think that's a bit steep, you know. Right, what am I doing? Um, I've got like this spatula thing. There you go. Probably best used to make cakes with, but uh, so what is it? Where's the description on this? Let it cool down a second. Um, there's no, there's no real description. Uh, is it? Is it going to be spicy with a sauce on? Probably. Are they just two chicken breasts? Probably. Now, I had a bread roll for this. Um, I, it, they were the same bread rolls from the um, baked bean burger things I did the other day. But I went out for a walk, come back, and they were, and they were gone. Um, it's still the six weeks holidays here in the UK. And when I go out, things get eaten by my daughters. <laughs> so...
slice of bread, as I don't have a bread roll. I went to find them, they were gone. Right, so what you do then, you've got this, um, it's, it's gonna be a mess. It's gonna be a mess, it's gonna be. <clears throat> I'm gonna get some. Get some of that on there. It's, well, it's supposed to be messy, isn't it, you know? This is gonna go everywhere messy. Pack that there. So that was the ranch sauce. And this is the red hot buffalo sauce. This should be tidy, shouldn't it? Look at that, yep, yeah, that's a mess. It's a real mess, isn't it? Bread on there. My goodness me, I better get the mop out. And get ready to mop the floor after this. Wow. It's messy, but my goodness me. Oh. It's everywhere. Um. Uh, it's a chicken burger. Essentially, it's a chicken burger with buffalo sauce on. Blooming messy. It's everywhere. It's all over the floor. But they call it messy, don't they? Let's get it all over the bread. Now, I'm going to say, I am going to say, that I like Frank's hot sauce, but I don't find it that hot. Considering something's called red hot buffalo wing sauce, you're expecting a load of fire in you. I mean, literally, there's the hot sauce. I'm literally dipping. I mean, I'm not, I'm not being too fiddly with it. I'm whacking it on the chicken burger and. It's nice, don't get me wrong. The, the chicken's nice and crispy. <clears throat> the ranch sauce is quite nice. The chicken's lovely by the way. The chicken's really good quality chicken. I don't know if it's just the name, I don't know if it's just that they've used that kind of hot sauce, hot sauce name to... Iceland like to team up with brands, they've teamed up with TGI's and now the Frank's Red Hot Sauce, Buffalo Wing Sauce. Mm. I am going to say though, <clears throat> I'm one in, <clears throat> I'm one in and 
Blooming heck. I'm filling up already. I don't know. Oh, well, I suppose I'll have to, won't I? I was gonna, like, it's impossible to eat now without. You could. Let's go. Let's get some more bread. <coughs> I've still got loads of this stuff. This is gonna end up all over my face. And my air fryer. So I, I, I suppose for your four pound, mm, it's definitely a meal. You can eat this on your own. It's definitely big enough to satisfy you, satisfy you for your tea or your lunch. There we go. There's a little bit of that left. I mean, it's going to end up everywhere, though, isn't it? It's going to go all over my face. It's going to go all over the floor. Nah, it's getting on. Let's make a right messy one, shall we? It's cold mess. Let's make a mess. Let's make a right old mess, shall we? I mean, look at this. I've got it on my... Philip's perfect draft. Oh yeah. Oh, it's em yeah. Right. This is going everywhere. It's all of my t-shirt. This is the messiest thing ever. It's filling as well. Really blowing filling. So filling in fact, I'm not sure if I'm gonna finish it. Is it worth it? Um, is it worth it for a quid? What I suggest you do is put it on a plate and sit at the table with it. Otherwise, it'll end up all over your t-shirt, all over your floor, and all over your perfect draft. Why? I'm gonna finish this because I paid four quid and I want to prove to, to everybody that it seemed really steep for two chicken burgers, but I tell you, it probably serves two, this. Probably serves two. Okay, I'm ready to rate it. Is it a mess? Yes. Is the Frank sauce decent enough? Absolutely, because honestly, after eating it and eating it and eating it, there is a lovely buildup of spice in my mouth. Is it the messiest thing I've ever eaten? <coughs> Without a shadow of a doubt. I can, I'm looking in the mirror, in my... My goodness me, it's everywhere. Right. Uh, <coughs> rating for the TGI Fridays. Chicken Louisiana hot mess with Frank's buffalo sauce and ranch sauce. 
blooming good. Blooming good, but it's messy. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.